Good morning. Good morning. We're getting Dunkin' Donuts in Milwaukee. Our New Year's Eve plans were very different than what we were expecting, but it's real cold out here. It's freezing. Are you gonna get a donut hole? They have panty cakes. Panty cakes. Looks so pretty. Yummy. That looks pretty. I got a wa, and I want to show off my nails that I didn't get to show off last night. So here they are. Green. Let's see your nails. No. <laughs> okay, bye then. Bye, Maddie. Oh. <laughs> Girls trip. Ah. Chicago bound. This is really dirty because I dropped it on the concrete yesterday. So. Let me see. And it's dented. Uh oh. Mm -hmm. There's a snowstorm out here. Gotta get air in these tires. I've never done this before. Look at how dirty my hands are. <laughs> I never do this. Her hands look like that, so mine can look like this. <laughs> I think that was really low. 37? Let's go see. Nope, that one's good. One more. Let's see how much this one is. Yep. Oh, 29. I've never once in my life done that. Really? Yeah. You learn something new every day, I guess. That's right. Oh, everybody does it for me. <laughs> Oh, you have to trigger. hold it? Yeah. It goes very, very slow. That's the one thing I don't like about the cameras. You can't just like instant zoom. Okay. <laughs> the hazards are the... Yeah, I had to zoom on the hazards. Well, you know what? If I get in an accident or something, they can't say going too fast for conditions. You know? Yeah. Like, that's one thing. Like, I will do what I can do to control the situation. Like, We're acting like this is the biggest blizzard of my life. Oh, excuse <laughs> me. You're gonna have to edit all the sound out of they this. Don't have masks, I what? This is how the camera angle always is. We have to recreate the scene of um, very cool. Green. How about green? I think green is kind of forish. 
few weeks ago, my family was on a safari. No, you're welcome to sit in the chair, use the mug or the phone. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I don't know if we'll get lost. Oh, we're not. I was completely ignoring her. I know, it doesn't look good. There's been so many people who Oh, that's trippy. First, the apple comes from here. Oh, that's trippy. Is he a speaker? <laughs> the bushiest beaver. <laughs> Will you guys do a picture of me over here? Yeah. <laughs> That's so funny. Oh, why didn't they keep these for themselves? Then, yeah, now look at me. Oh my. The, the beer slime. You should edit it to say Paul's girl. Ew, bro. <laughs> Point for Team Kelly answering back so quickly. <laughs> Massive catch by Team Kelly. Oh God! That's an error. But it's good. Oh, and that's a point for Team Kelly taking the two-one lead. Game point. Toby tying it up at two. Okay, we'll see who I have to go. You gotta find the winner. This is the winner. Next point wins. Come on. All right. All right. Pretty evenly matched here. Trading some catches. Who is gonna strike first? Some massive catches on both sides. That was an error. That was an error. But that one is fair, and Team Toby wins. Woo! Go Toby! Toby. Toby. Go Toby! Toby. Go Toby! Go Toby! Go Toby! Yeah, I will. Magical wintry night in Chicago. Flurries are coming down. We might be trapped here. Not sure. We're trapped. Oh my god. Um, I can drive in a lot of things, but I'm a little concerned. What way to Nando's? We're going to a place, what's it called? Nando's. Nando's in Chicago for dinner. It's supposed to be like a really, really good place. I believe them. They say they well, love it. I've never had a fast food. I've never had it. Oh. It's like Pyrenees. Pyrenees. Oh. We need to take an Uber. Let's go. We need to go. It's 4.30. 
four minute walk, you say? Wait, hold on. I don't know which way. Sure, it's a four minute walk or drive. At least you're saying walk. I'm on the ride. Okay, let's okay. go. Can we go? Yeah, it's. it's, it's Walking in a winter wonderland. Vandals. <laughs> Yummy. Okay, taste test. Never had this place before. Chicken Sammy. Who took my silverware? Oh, that is yummy. Where is it? Oh. This is so good, Maddie. Thank you for your recommendation. I always wanted to try this. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> I'm so sorry <laughs> to my brother, to my mother. I'm so sorry and I'm so scared when people don't label their personal food. <laughs> okay, hi everyone. So <laughs> it's all been fun and games until now because here's the situation. We were to even start. So the highway has become unmanageable and we can't get home. We spun out on the highway and then the, oh my God, this is a dead end. No outlet if you go straight, turn right here. So Serma, so turn right And the, we spun out really bad, but Brooke handled it. into the boonies. This is scary, everyone look. We're on a complete dead end. This is our actual Blair Witch Project. We spun out. Brooke handled it really, really good, like a champ. We didn't go in the ditch or anything. But the thing that was not so good was then the wheel locked up and a semi was coming right for us. So we had to get out and run. <laughs> relaxing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So we are safe at a ho another hotel, which I didn't even explain what happened last night, so they don't know that. But we are at a hotel. You can see it's lovely. But we were not planning to be at this hotel at all. We, um, Alicia kind of explained the story, but basically we were driving home from Chicago and the roads were not great, but like I remember thinking at first like, oh, this is fine. Like I felt okay, I felt good. And then we got a little more north and it started to go downhill very fast. I mean, snow covered, completely road. It looked like a plow had never gone through. I put my flashers on, I was going what? 30 35 yeah. at the highest it was super windy too very windy like i felt there were mo little moments when i was slipping and i'm just like oh okay okay and i would always get back well then we were driving and i just completely no i had no control it started to spin and then it went fully around and then came and we were like like this is the road our car was like this so and then my my steering wheel locked up completely i couldn't move like it was like it felt like it was like I couldn't turn it so I was trying to correct us once we came to a complete stop I was trying to correct us to get us back on the road and um, I couldn't and then I didn't notice that they pointed it out to me that there was a semi coming so and I couldn't the only way I knew my steering wheel locks up sometimes and the only way that you get it unlocked is by turning the car off and turning it back on so I knew I had to do that but there was a semi coming so we, I, it happened so fast, but we literally just, all of us hopped out of the car and went to the ditch, like ran on foot. Because I'm like, if this semi crashes into our car, we're, we're either at very best injured horribly. So here's Maddie, <laughs> we're telling the story. Much more likely dead though, in millions of pieces. 
yeah because semis the thing is is i'm not saying the semi driver was stupid but they can't stop on a whim and also even changing lanes like so we just did what was safest and we just ran to the side of the road luckily the semi went over so the car was completely fine and we hopped right in it right away i turned my car off and turned it right back on and the steering wheel unlocked luckily and i was able to like get back to driving but from there on out i mean i'm not really an anxious driver but like i could i knew i could not continue so we are in where are we pleasant prairie yeah we're in pleasant prairie was because this happened in illinois this didn't this happened we were like a little bit south of the border of wisconsin so this just goes to show you that like going and i don't know if you're not from here but we still had how many hours we had like an hour and whatever to get to milwaukee to drop maddie off that's not even where our end destination was and yes i heard it gets better north like my mom i called my mom and she said there was no snow but it just wasn't gonna happen so we no. pulled over we tried to make a game plan <laughs> in the bathroom we, yeah so i i think i might have said this already too but the bathroom situation this whole weekend this entire day actually has been awful and the cherry <laughs> on top was when we pulled over we had to go to the bathroom we're trying to figure out where to go my that's so loud <laughs> can you pick any other time to organize your ice and this <laughs> bathroom you can believe that it had no no stall doors on the stalls it was so filthy <laughs> i turned right around and went right back what about out. the cardboard boxes yeah the rugs like absorbing all the the snow and <laughs> wet water whatever was these cardboard boxes like just flattened out in the yeah. door so that was my first red flag and the bathroom was awful so i still yeah. haven't gone and every it's bathroom so we went in this entire day was like disgusting it's crazy like we we're having a bathroom yeah. we're having many problems but <laughs> so we're here for the night because it's supposed to it's like it's still snowing and it's not really supposed to let up i'm hoping that i mean obviously i would like to hit the road early but i'm not leaving until the snow is done and the plows have been out because i my car is i know it doesn't have good tires it the reason we took my car is because we had no knowledge of this winter storm apparently our friend knew about it but not any of these two our other well, friend did you know about this storm no i oh. didn't because um i looked at chicago weather and i don't know if maybe i was just i don't know i was looking on the iphone so i know that's not very accurate i should have used like a more accurate weather app but i it said nothing it just said partly cloudy and i was like okay fine that's great you know whatever because my tires are not great for snow driving like this car has never left north carolina this is the first time it's been here and we don't like get snow there so i don't really care about like tires and stuff like it's not something you really think about until they're like really bad so we did do our best effort though and fill them up with air we did on the way there because it started to like i felt like i was not in control either so we filled it up with air and then it got so better <laughs> Well, it did get better. We had you know? we had somewhere to be, so we didn't have a choice. Yeah. But that's the story, basically. So we're staying here for the night, and we're gonna make the most out of it. XOXO, Michael. Michael. <laughs> what? Oh. More tomorrow, XOXO, Michael. Bye. This is the lost tapes they're gonna find. Mm -hmm. I'm so scared. <laughs> I'm so scared. <laughs> When people don't label their personal foods. Tell me I'm the only one that you know. Life could be a dream, sweetheart. Sweet.